Growing up, computer science wasn't always the career I planned to pursue. In fact, I was on track to pursue music at an academic and professional level. But once I realized the connection between music and math, I fell in love with STEM and fell in love with coding. During my freshman year, I looked for more opportunities to put coding into action and to build real solutions. But like every freshman, I had no idea where to start. My mentor at the time was the lead of the Google Developer Student Club here at Howard University. So she told me, join the club and we have workshops and we build projects. So I joined and soon after I heard about the solution challenge where we get to team up with members and we get to build real life solutions with code. And I was like, okay, this is different. The solution challenge helped me become more confident in coding and more confident in life, really. I was very shy before joining the GDSC club. So the leadership part, it was not for me. But working with the club members on the solution challenge has definitely helped me in taking responsibility, initiating action, and networking with other students. On the yard, we were just looking around and we noticed a lot of people were rapping. We noticed people were showing their art around. And I was like, okay, why don't we make a platform where everyone can come together and show off what they do best. Okay, so the reason that we need this painting is because we're going to try to make a platform for black creators in an augmented reality space. The user will enter the museum-like setting. They'll be able to walk around and pick up the painting, look at it at all angles. You'll even be able to stand and see it on the side. What's the inspiration for this piece here? Uh, so this piece is actually commissioned. Um, there was a Howard uh, artist that needed uh, cover art for his Being family. at Howard University, Seeing so many HBCU graduates get full-time jobs after college motivated me to keep pushing because this field is hard, but at least I know it's possible to succeed. So when I realized that I was still shy, but I was taking on this leadership kind of aspect, I decided why not apply to be on the core team. And now I'm here and I am the lead of the Google Developer Student Club here at Howard University. We have more than 200 members and we provide hands-on workshops and we learn technology that help us become more career ready. One of my classmates, he's from Lagos, Nigeria, and he wanted to minor in computer science, but he was a little scared because the major's hard. So I told him, join our club, try things out. He came a few times and we taught him about coding and technologies. And now he's interviewing for internships next year and he will have his first job in tech. When I was growing up, there's this movie called Ratatouille. He said, anyone can cook. And I'll tell anyone who wants to actually code, anyone can code, as long as you put your mind to it and stay dedicated, you can code. I was a shy girl who simply wanted to build solutions for my community. At first, my plan was to kind of blend in and just be a software engineer and stay quiet, keep my head low. But after becoming a lead, I realized I want to do more. I want to found a company, I want to be a CEO, I want to do something really big and no longer blending it. <laughs>